Hey everybody, it's Jerry the PA. I'm gonna tell you about why I like to use a TENS unit for visceral abdominal massage and visceral treatment. First of all, from your favorite store, you can get a very simple TENS unit. If you come over here and look at this TENS unit, it will come with uh, typically four pads. We're gonna use all four pads. It'll come with two sets of wires which we're gonna to use to connect the pad to the most important part, the machine. Number one, make sure that, of course, you have fresh batteries in your machine. All machines are a little different, but they all have the same core function. Number one, just pop open the top and you'll have a setting for intensity and timing. And I always tell everybody to start low. Turn it to the one, you'll hear a little click. Turn the second one to a one, so you've got intensity and frequency both on one. Next, your machine may have a little door in the front, which you can open, and you'll adjust the mode. Most of them have several different modes. Just start off by picking the normal mode. So now your machine is set up. Next thing, you're gonna take your two sets of wires, and there's a port for each wire on the top. Make sure you put it in and you hear that little click on each side. And then after this, we're gonna take our TENS unit pads and you'll have a red and a black and just make sure that they're really firmly connected in there. And these pads are great. You could use them 20, 30 times or more. We've got all of our pads set up. Now everybody, our target is uh, the visceral system. We want to work on digestion, stomach acid, nervous stomach, vagus nerve. And if you look at the stomach here, I normally would have people put two on each side as the first treatment. And then the second treatment we'll look at in a minute is around the belly button. So you always want to avoid the bone. Everybody remember, don't put these pads on a bone. And you're going to find a nice soft area by the lower rib, close to the belly button. And then up top, closer by the breastbone, we've got a black one here. We're going to put the red up top. Keep on the soft area. Don't go near the ribs. And then right on the other side here. Now here's where we like to start looking for some magic. Hopefully you or whoever you're doing this on might feel a little bit of the gentle pulsations with the abdomen. And what I tell people to do is you can come back to your machine and adjust it. Maybe go up to the two a little bit on each side until you start to feel it. Sometimes you might even see the muscle jump a little bit. Everybody, this is working on the solar plexus. It should help with digestion. It might even help calm anxiety, help with that nervous stomach, the butterflies in your stomach. And I would tell people to use this once or twice a day 10 to 20 minutes. The second treatment, so we're gonna turn this off for a minute. And then the second treatment I like to do is around the belly button. And I usually go about two fingers away from the belly button. And we're gonna go at nine o'clock. And then about two fingers over at 12. And then we're gonna go at six o'clock. And then I'm gonna go at three o'clock this way. I've got all the wires pointed in the right direction so there's no tangling. And I'm gonna turn this back on to the one, the intensity and the frequency of the beats. And again, you have the freedom to just play with it. If you don't feel much, maybe go up to the two or three. If it feels a little too strong, you could dial it down. Ideally, you'll feel a little gentle pulsation from this TENS unit current. And you can use this several times a day, 10 or 20 minutes. It's a cheap product. It has really no side effects. If you don't like it, you can just take it right off. At the end, you'll turn it off and you can put those probes back on the little plastic sheet and you can use these over and over again until they're no longer sticky. Again, thanks for watching. Hopefully this cheap treatment will really help with some of your gut and even nervous issues. And of course, this is not official medical advice. Uh, make sure you consult your practitioners.
Have a great day, everybody.